a lot of these celebrities who started when they were younger started when they you know started a youtube channel tell me a little bit about like the journey of rebranding because i'll use bad baby for an example and what vicky i know that's like not your favorite person to talk about but i'll use her for an example you know no, I, I don't care about talking about her okay perfect I don't, I don't have a problem with her god bless her yeah okay good yeah um you know she don't want to be called catch me outside girl anymore and same with you like y'all are kind of saying the same things like we've grown we're not the same person we were when we were 16, 17, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just a totally different person now. Can you talk to me more about that and how you've grown? Um, well, you want to go first? You want to talk about, I'll go. Or was that, was that question more direct? It's not either, both. Mm -hmm. You go ahead first. Okay. Uh, well, when I first came out, I was 20 years old. I blew up at 21. I'm 25 right now. Okay. I'll be 26 this year, but, uh, I blew up, I, I started getting famous at 20 and I blew up at 21. And um, like I, my story will remain the same no matter how, from the very first interview I, I put out. So uh, I grew up in an abusive home. My dad wasn't in my life. My stepdad who was there had died. And which I thank God that he was even in my life because the time period that he died when I was 14. So the 14 years that he was in my life, that gave me an experience of having a father. So thank God for the time that he was there in my life. Yeah. Um, we had we used to have the dumpster dive. My mom, you know, it's seasons in life. Sometimes my mom got it, sometimes my mom don't, but she had to raise six kids by herself. So uh, we, went, we wasn't, when she did have it, we weren't the wealthiest, but she had enough to, to provide. When she don't, we gotta go dumpster dive, we gotta go steal food, you know, we sleeping at friends' houses, we sleeping in cars and just stuff like that. And uh, what's the name? So um, like me having to wear hand-me-down clothes, uh, still, um, still clothing shoes, check, checking gym lockers when in school, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, for the most part, I never had nothing. Yeah. And, um, but when I, as I was getting famous, when I started getting famous as Boont Gang, um, First off, I never meant to call myself Boom Gang. It's okay. just Boom. Yeah, I meant okay. to call myself Boom. But when I made my slogan, Boom Gang, I was saying Boom's gang is a whole lot of gang stuff. Got it. You're saying like yo, the people that support you, your crew. You, yeah. Okay, got it. Okay. But, but people called me Boom Gang, so I just went ahead and, and went along with it. Yeah. Yeah. Because my, my name is not Boom Gang, it's Boom. My okay. nickname. My nickname. Right. It's boom. We all had nicknames. My brother' nickname is uh is a uh, Tuka. We call him Tuka Nuka. You know okay. what I'm saying? I, yeah. So my mom just she uh one of my other brothers. Vicky, what's was, your nickname? Vicky. <laughs> oh, just Vicky. You didn't give her yeah. a nickname. Your well, family. Her name, her, name one? her name Victoria. So her nickname Vicky. No, I oh. meant from your family oh. though. Like, did oh, your family oh, give her? Oh, um, they will call me Vic. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. So. My other brother was Scooter, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, we all had family nicknames. I just, you know, mine just, I just decided to take mine and just, uh, cause I didn't know what to call myself. I, I, was, I had this plan, I'm like, man, I'm gonna become famous. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't know what to call myself. And uh, cause I never liked Boom as a, as a kid, but I just I just went ahead along, went, went with it. But I was saying was, um, so after me going through all that stuff as a child, never having nothing and everything like that, uh, and being abused and all that, foster care and all that, like I just had a lot of anger in me, you know? Mm -hmm. I was just, I was living in the world and then I got famous living dead in sin, sleeping with everybody, doing drugs and all that, you know? And so uh, my heart was wicked. I was prideful, um, fornicating drugs, you know what I'm saying? Just, it was just, uh, I was lost. Then I start feeling I was depressed. I was hurt. I was already hurt and depressed from my childhood. Mm -hmm. Then I get famous, you know what I'm saying? And I, the, I, I thought I'm like, okay, if I get famous, then I could get rich. Yeah. But the way I got famous, it didn't come with riches because people was really scared to work with a type of guy mm -hmm. like me. And me, I was like, I didn't feel like I had nothing. I was so wild with it. A lot of the stuff I did, it was most of it was staged. But I came out, I came out so raw 
it look it, it even look real people just ain't really want to do business with me yeah i was i was it looks very real yeah but yeah. a lot of a lot of it, a lot of it was staged okay but um so most of it was real and a lot of it was like some of it was real a lot of it was staged can you give me an example of a like a staged and something that was real like the difference um well uh the lobster the lobster, the lobster. I got permission to, to do that video. And so it stayed. Yeah, it stayed. Yeah, a, a lot, like a lot of videos. I asked to do. I said, uh, what was the real one? Um, the puppy that was fake. The puppy was fake. The, the um, the watch that was fake. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that about Popeyes. That was real. But any anything after Popeyes and Dunkin' Donuts, for the most part, I mean, the real. You can't stage me jumping on the dude uh thing in New York. I jumped on his thing for real. Yeah. But. Like anything that dealt with like stores and me selling stuff, I got permission to do videos. They get they actually played a part to do a video. Okay. I said, I said, hey, I'm I'm getting I show them my views on social media. I say, hey, I do this and do this. Will you be a part of this? And they're like, yeah. So that's why that's how I don't have theft charges and, and nothing like that. And I was wondering that too, where like the charges. Okay. Yeah, all, the shoes, all that stuff the stage. No, my my if you look back at my charges, I got gun charges and drug charges. Okay. And that's for being stupid for posting guns on the internet. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I got a hit and run charges, but I don't got like no uh I got like petty stuff and that was that stuff from like when I was teens. But charges now I got like gun charges and drug charges. Like none none of that boot gang stealing stuff is 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 on my record because it was all it was all set up. But um the question, the question what you said was my about the growth. The growth so yeah. uh so just me getting famous and um having uh having all that like Ill illness in my heart and I was being lost, God had his way of reaching people. You know, one man plants, another man waters, but God had the power to 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 let that seed grow, harvest, you know. Right. So when I went to jail, I went to jail for on a hit and run charge. Mm -hmm. And uh, oh, and I got a battery charge, but that's fighting. But that's why I'm saying it's like I was supposed to be playing the character and I actually became that character. Like I had, you know what I'm saying? I actually became a, a, a villain and that's not even who I am. Yeah. Like that, that's it not even who seem I am. It like that's who you are. It's, it's not yeah. who I am. But I, I, I got so caught up into trying not to lose fame and yeah. stuff. I, I thought, oh, I got to be him. This is how I got famous. I got to keep it. So I gotta I gotta remain this character. And um, but my whole goal was to get rich. Like, but yeah. it, it just didn't work out the way I thought it would. And I felt I was lost, I was depressed, I was hurt, and I didn't feel like I didn't want to be I didn't want to be boom gang no more because I'm like, it just didn't work out. I wanna I wanna be who I really am. I wanna show people that I'm really a nice guy, I'm really a loving guy, I'm really a respectful guy. When you was talking to me, I said yes, ma'am. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I like I wanted to show people that when I first came out and told people that I'm changing, that I'm good, people threw all type of dirt on my name. They was like, "No, you boom gang, you this and you that, you that, you this, you that, you that." But it's like from then to now, I'm a man of God. Yeah. It's like you know, God says that how the world can recognize His children by the love that they display. Yeah. So it's like before I didn't, I wasn't this showing displaying love. I was mean, proudful, and everything. Now I'm a lot more humble. I am nothing without God. You know. Do you I'm, think your I'm, fans are a little bit more accepting of the change now that they see that it's you know it's more long term and it's not just a a phase. A lot of people once once I told people see I. I changed my name in 2018, 19, 2018. So I got famous 2017. I changed my name 2018. For real? It only took me a year to realize that this is not the life I want to live. Wow. I'm 25 and I did a whole 180. It's people 40, year, 40 years old still ain't learning their lesson. Right. It's right. because I was not that type of person for real. That's right. not who I am for real. That's why I changed so quickly. That's good. But it's like when I went to jail, I got introduced to Jesus. I always believed in Jesus, but I never knew to live for him. Mm. So 
Um, I learned about Jesus when I went to jail, came out still living a worldly life. I didn't have an example. I didn't have no guidance. And that's what happens when men, when anybody don't have older men, mm -hmm. no guidance, no example. They just mm -hmm. go off what they're taught from the world and from the environment. Mm -hmm. But see, now that I'm older and I'm maturing, what I've learned that this world is the total opposite of the kingdom of God. This mm -hmm. world is, is ruled by Satan. This is Satan's kingdom, the world. That's why, sure. that's why God, he loves, he loves humility. He loves humble. But in the world, people look at you like you weak and that, that you humble, that you ready to quick, uh, quick to forgive somebody. People look at you like you weird. Yeah. But in God's eyes, that's what you're supposed to do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's like, I break down and cry. I say, I'm a baby in the spirit. When it comes to God, I'm, I'm breaking down and crying. Yeah. See? People who are believers, they understand they, and they know that cry, it, it brings healing. But in the world, you got to hold that in. You know, you got to hold that in. You, you Men don't cry. Yeah. You know, like that's why I'm saying it's like it's the world is a total opposite from the kingdom. Not for real. But, um, and do you have, not, you mentioned like your stepfather. I want to go back a little bit to that and how he was a huge like impact on your life. Can right, you I was going to say this. I was going because you asked me, is my fans more accepted now? When I came out and told people that I was a believer, everything changed for me. When I came out and told people that I believe in Jesus, boy, boy, it's like I told I did that last year. So I changed my name in 2018. So that's three years of telling people that I changed and people didn't accept it. Soon as I bring soon as I bring God in it, everything changed for me. People accepted it. God and that's true. God's word. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. I didn't know you changed your name like three years ago. Um, well, I, I years think now. four years, even four years. I think the, I think it was like two years ago when I first heard that you were changing your name and that. And I, to your point, and then like about a year later, it followed up with like um, you accepting Christ. Okay. And so, yeah, yeah, like I think that to your point, it is people, you kind of like, I don't know. I think people maybe started to take you a little bit more seriously the more they realized that this wasn't a phase, honestly. Like, I think they they saw it in you a little bit more. And the content that you post is a lot more spiritual than before. And it's just like, I nobody, nobody just, can, if you're not walking with God for real, you don't got to be a perfect man when you walk with God. Because, you know, this journey is, I mean, this is a journey. Repentance is a journey. Transformation is a journey. It takes time, you know? Yeah. But it's like nobody just can't turn on the camera and then spit scripture and then spit it in a way where people can understand it. You really got to be applying his word to your life and really seeking God to be able to do that. So yeah. when I turn that camera on and minister, give scripture and post it, you know, it's real. You can't deny that. Yeah. You can tell that I'm really putting an effort. And 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 that's what that's why people have been start taking me serious. But also, too, it was probably hard. It was mainly hard because I kept getting deleted social media and I and I, I kind of shut. Social media scared me because it's like when I first got famous, I didn't I didn't know the Internet was like that. Like I didn't know like interviewers, they you pour my heart out to interviewers telling my lifestyle and then they make fun of me and stuff like that. You know, <laughs> or, or like I, I didn't know people yeah. was like I didn't know people yeah. was like you trusted so, the wrong people. I jumped crazy. That's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So it's like so it's like I was like. I was 20, 21 years old. 22 is still a baby. 23 is still a baby. 24, 25, you start to get up there. I'm 25. But yeah. it's like, at, at then, like that junk, that junk had, I, I just, once I got deleted, I just stayed away really from social media because I was scared of it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I didn't know people was like that. 